training, I thought Simone looked a little bit more stable than I've seen her. This very tricky makes it look so easy. The power and strength you need to be able to do that on the beam and control it. Really big. Just a little bit tentative on that. She's a little careful going from one move to another. She'll lose some connection, but. And watch this combination right here. It's gonna be three elements in a row. I can't spring layout, immediate layout, perfect. Really good, really, really good. but it's certainly not going to derail this competition for her, that's for sure. But what really seals this beam routine is coming up right here, the dismount. Probably the hardest dismount in the world. And she does it better than anyone. Full twisting double somersault, the hop forward on the landing. But she is not happy because of that one major balance check. Coach Amy Borman right there, they've been together since just about the beginning. And she's hurt. And she's got her hand on her back and... She starts her team the two and a half turns. Beautiful. That's very hard to do, especially in that position. This is beautiful though, right here. Three skills in a row, great extension. Look at her jump in the air and just very nice positions. Four inches wide, look for that beam, put your feet down exactly like that. Can't do that any better. And here's a little balance check she had here. Watch, she turns, her, her, her hips were a little off and her back foot came off the beam. You know, it wasn't terrible, but she will lose a few tens for that. Of course, this mount right here, done in combination, which makes it even harder. Most people do a double back, but she adds a full twist on it. She gets higher off that beam than most girls get <laughs> on the floor exercise. <laughs> 